Hello, hello to the amazing people, the Nehmer here, and welcome to another episode of Survival Fountain of Youth. Also, welcome to the channel. I play a long series of games I really enjoy. So, find your favorite playlist, watch it, uh, enjoy it, like, subscribe, all that good stuff. As for this game, it is a first person crafting a survival game. And there's a full long playlist in the comments and description for you to watch if you want to watch it from the start so right now i am on this uh, copper island right and we want to find some copper so i didn't play for a week uh because well i was playing crop rotation and something's got a gift so i decided it was this game although i still enjoy it i just enjoy it other games just a tiny bit more so yeah i had to prioritize anyway i think i want to go here I think I want to find like a tree somewhere here and like map a little bit more of the place. Let's see the inventory. Okay. I never read this fully. I should finish reading it. Yeah, let's finish reading it. 20 minutes. There we go. Living water cures diseases. Okay. That's kind of cool, I guess. Okay. So we got some ropes. We got some strong branches. Okay. Strong branches. I don't feel like I need to carry with me. So let's store them in here, I guess. So yeah, this is just like a, hmm, how should we call it? Like temporary setup for me here. With these boxes, I would really like to make myself a proper home. Somewhere where I can enjoy my time. Yeah, I should definitely put these here. Let's see, when I'm standing in the sun right now, do I get overheated? Burning hot sun. I'm under the open sun, my clothes do not provide complete sun protection, I should first find the shade to recover or get sunburn. Okay. Well, I do have like... Oh, I didn't have any. Oh. I took the clothes off, right. Because so I was like, who needs that, right? Well, turns out I do. <laughs> so we're going to need to make some more. Mm. Right. How do we do this? Do we go exploring now or do we start crafting? I think I said I'm gonna cra craft first, right? But I would like to make a house next to the copper deposit. I don't need to like actually do that, I guess. Hmm. You know what? It's fine. We can make a dock next to the copper deposit, right? Yeah, let's uh, make a house. Let's see, if I like sprint, towards one of these trees how bad will it become yeah, let's go exploring a little bit well it's like so many things i want to do but you can't really do it all at once it is what it is i'm a little bit worried about getting like overheated but i do have treated formic acid also it seems like i heard something it seems like while i don't have the what is it called the leather gear on it's not really that bad I am venturing out without any food and water though, so that's probably not a really good idea, but hey It is what it is. Okay, let's move on Okay, this place up front seems a little bit hard to tra traverse mm. Okay, Mr. Tegu, you did scare me, but that's about it. No cutter available. Really? Ooh. Oh, that's a snake there. Oh, it has a huge range. Okay. I guess you have to do it like this. Never tried, like, hitting a snake from so, so close by. Okay, I'm poisoned, so let's grab some anti-venom. There we go. Okay, and there's some scorpions here. I kind of want to kill them. I think actually I can just stab them, right? These shouldn't have like as big range as the snake does. Oh, it did. It looked like it is trying to to jump. Okay, there's some mushrooms in here. Oh, they will regrow. That's kind of cool. Okay, got some living water. <laughs> so, uh, biggest mistake was when I started playing this game on like normal. Difficulty because I can really do better than that, but it's okay, I guess. Ancient drawing. 
24, Song of the Last Days. When the war with the immortals ended, the story of this tribal nation ended with it. For 16 years, people were dying of pestilence all over the island. They destroyed the poisoned wells and created new clay wells for rainwater. But it was too late, and soon there was no one left to drink from them. And there were those who sailed off into the fogs of Bimimi Belt on their simple boats, but no one ever returned, and the red water stole their fate. And on the 17th year after the ship burning, the last mortal in the last village took his last breath well there's like this is like a huge story we're gonna read it once we collect it all so okay and now i would kind of like let's make a cutter i guess so we can start collecting stuff oh chance of injury 17 percent what's that dark in the dark I can't see well and my actions are inaccurate. Chance of injury while working in dark is very high. I should light the fire wait till morning. This is new. Darkness inside caves, that's new. I don't think that was part of the game. I think they... Oh, I am overheating. Hello. Okay. So I guess it just needed to be like a little bit hotter. I don't think I need fat. I definitely I'll just four minutes. That's like four seconds in the game's time. Okay. Okay, I can hear a little bit of a lizard there. So before I overheat, I need to find some shade. There's some shade here. Ah. What a wonderful day sitting in the shade, enjoying my time. Exploring the What are these? They look like they have fruits on them. Okay, so we can go up here now. Oh, I did hear a lizard. I can see the lizard. Okay, Mr. Lizard, wanna fight? I'm ready. Turns out I was not ready. This thing can leap. Like, what in the world was that? Tegu hide. I'm gonna grab some Tegu hide. And we got some meat and bones. I'll grab the bones. I'm gonna go into the shade. There we go. Let's make another cutter, I guess. Hopefully I'm still in the shade. I am. Oof. What time of the day is it? Yeah, it's like noon. That's why everything sucks right now. There we go. Um, I'm kind of curious what that thing is, though. Agavi. Three minutes. I guess I can spare three minutes. Okay. What's that? I mean, while standing in shade, I can also look at the map. Let's see. So these are coffee trees. Okay, there's a Tegu there as well. Did it, like, poison me or something? No, didn't. Okay. Oh, we did draw, grab the, the, the raw meat from something. Okay. What is Tegu hide used for? Crafting resources can be gathered from Tegu carcass. Do not craft an item or find a recipe. Okay, let's head upwards. I can hear a harpy up there. Okay, we got some sticks here. There's a heavy stone. Not sure if I can carry it without overburdening myself. Okay, yep, I'm ready. You can come. There we go. Don't fall down, please. Take the feather at least. There we go. It is getting hotter and hotter. Oh, look at that. That's interesting. It's like a... Oh, this is shade. Good. So I got the old barrel. I don't care about that. A ship barrel. A mobile container that holds liquid. Prevents liquid loss from evaporation. Can hold 40 units. That's pretty cool, I guess. Mm. Can I throw it? No, I can just drop it. I can throw this thing, though. No? Oh no, that's for the spear. Never mind. Uh, so I guess we can go up here and map. Thing is though, it's super hot, so I'm pretty sure I don't want to be doing the mapping right now. Yeah. Okay, that was scary. So I'm thinking like, okay, it's cloudy. I'm thinking I'm just going to take like one hour break here.
Okay, I'm not overheating anymore, so that's good. Okay, let's go up here and map. Let's see. This does seem like it's like... <laughs> it's actually not the highest point we can reach. Like that is, I think. Up there. But you know what? This is what the game intended, so... Start mapping. Okay. Chronicles, Tegu, Alo. Oh, there we go. We found the copper deposit. Turns out it's like in this valley down here, so we can't really make a dock next to it anyway, which was my idea that I had, but hey, it is what it is. Okay, well, there we go. Okay, so yeah, now we're gonna relax here a little bit. Yeah, I'm like super hungry. We'll need to go home, get something to eat. What's the time? 10 minutes. Okay. Okay, we have plenty of time to do more stuff in this episode. Okay. Ooh. So I wonder if I go down there, how hard will it to get back up? Oh, there's something here. Oh, it's a mapping charcoal. Isn't that just cool? Oh, look, somebody was mapping. Why can't I just take their map? Right? That would be nice. Uh, what's the time? Okay, it's getting a little bit late. Okay, let's see. Okay, sun is still kind of hot. So now I need to figure out a nice way to go down there. So that's the valley where the copper mine is. Okay. Okay, let's take a one hour break in the shade here, I think. There we go. Good. And now I think we can just... Oh, hello there, Mr. Stick. I like that. Okay, that's the harpy nest from the harpy that I killed. Let's grab its eggs. And let's grab the feathers. Worms I don't really need. So now it's getting a little bit dark. Okay. If I go down here, will I be able to get back up? Well, hopefully. Okay, good. What are these? They look like cacti. Prickly pear. Pieces of cactus. Let's grab one piece of cactus. Let's see if we can actually chew on it. Crafting resource. We can make alcohol from it. Oh, from cactus and agave. I see. I mean... Sure, I guess. What's this? Pile of scrap. Oh, it's a bone from some big animal. Okay. Interesting. So if you check the map, there should also be dragon fruit in here. Where is it? Is this the dragon fruit? No, it's just a dead tree. I want my dragon fruit. I'm, I'm thirsty, hungry, and all of that. It seems like it's in this direction. Um, what's that? Oh yeah, that tree, and oh, that's fine. We don't need any of that right now. No. Okay. So it should be somewhere near the nest, actually. Yeah. So up there, maybe. If we can get up there again, we can. Good. So it's this. A dragon fruit? No. This looks like it might be. Is this it? No. Where is it? Hmm. Weird. Okay. Well, I don't want to spend too much time looking for one mystical fruit tree can do without there's the nest there's the prickly pear prickly pear I didn't loot this one right yep I didn't okay <laughs> it's a mystery it's like it should be somewhere here but there's none okay let's go into the valley okay there's some more of these things here not sure how many I want to grab. Oh, this seems to be... Oh, what's that? It's a sparkling tree. 
It's a sparkly tree. There's a lot of these cacti here. So for now, I'll just be like ignoring them. Otherwise, I'm going to spend the whole night gathering that. Plate in the tree. Oh, hello. Song of the best people. And to bring justice and prevent conflict, the elders have spoken. Only the best are worthy of prolonged life. Oof, nasty. Since those most useful to the tribe will create even more good by living together longer. May the ones who desire to live longer be ready to prove their value to their tribe. The great council and to the fountain itself. Well, I guess that works as long as there is no corruption. May the ones who desire the miraculous potion be prepared to face trials. May those... Why do I have the bow equipped? That was weird. Oh, wait. My spear broke. Okay. Uh, oh, dude, this is not good. What are you doing, dude? That's sick. Okay. Well, first time I was really using the block a lot. Uh, <laughs> all right. Well, let's put one of these on. Minor cut. Take medicine to remove it. Uh, these are really bad. Like, they move. Like, did you see how it moved? Jaguar tendons, bones. Oh, that's also new. Moonlight can be like... No, we can't do stuff with the moonlight. Okay, can I finally read in peace? Or anything else is gonna attack me? Ah, dude. Dude, I just want to read. Like, is that so bad? Like, I just want to read. Can I please read in peace? Thank you. <laughs> May the ones who desire the miraculous potion be prepared to face trials. May those whose bravery, mastery, knowledge and strength are proven beyond doubt be called the best people. May the best people consume the blessed water to prolong their youth. And all who heard this agree. This is a fair solution and shall not shall be set henceforth and forever and ever. Well, obviously it was not that great since this is how it ended, but okay. <laughs> uh, I like, I have a spear right now, so I'm a little bit worried. Seems like that's it though. Okay, so we found the copper deposit and there's a lot of copper here. Okay. Right, so what's my plan right now? Well, I need to eat something at some point. What are these? Nothing? Oh, they are something. Elephant ear. Okay. Well, just a long leaf to me. It's a long leaf to me and that's about it. Okay, let's see what else do we have here. Oh. Bamboo. Okay, where, where there is bamboo, there should be water, no? Tego response in 8 days. Jaguar response in 20 days. Thank God for that. Uh, right, bamboo's really good. I like bamboo. Yeah, it seems like this is a well, but it's dry. So... 
Unless I can find some water somewhere, I'm gonna have to go back. What else do we have here? Oh, there's a harpy here also. Hello. I don't wanna mess with that right now. Okay, that removed the cut, so that's pretty good. Um... So there's two things I could do here. I could wait for the morning, grab some copper, go back. Or I could like make a small camp here. That's kind of alright, I guess. Will this overburden me? No. Let's bring what we have back home, I guess. This will overburden me. Okay. What can we drop? We can drop one stone off. Yeah, let's do that. Since, so it's gonna be easier to find. I'll place it next to the copper mine here. I guess I could put some other stuff next to here, but like, it's okay. Okay. Grab these. Traveling during the night is probably a good idea. This was painful though. And scary at the same time. Okay. So, I guess next time I should bring some water so I can stay out there for longer. What's well, okay, at least I didn't get poisoned. So I was like, what is this, right? Big branches and small sticks. Now, big branches are really useful. Would this be a good place for a camp? I don't know, not really. No, I just want to grab the stuff from here. And that's about it. I'm going to grab all the copper. Yeah, so let's go home, take some rest, uh, food up, water up, grab the copper, see if we can make something out of it. But I think to make usage out of copper, we're going to need some other things which will enable it. But pretty happy with this episode so far. I found what I wanted to find, the copper, that's why we're here on this island. So I need some more weapons, definitely. Okay, this is probably rare. Agave, no, we already found that. Terminalia. Yeah, it's like, let's not gather this during the night. That's a really bad idea. I'm being chased by a jumping lizard. I kind of also need to heal. So I'm thinking, let's go grab some palm trees. And then we're going to loop back to our base. I know I'm not going to my base, by the way. I also want to try hunting the buffaloes with my... Uh, can you please leave me alone so I can grab that? Thank you very much. So with alcohol, we'll be able to do some good techie stuff, right? Okay, so these we picked up. Okay, I see what I did here. All right. Still not sure 100% about the whole feature and stuff, how it works. But I think it doesn't matter how much you gather. The replenishing rate is just slow either way. So these we need for bandages, basically. There's some dates there, that's cool, I guess. Okay. There we go. Let's go back home, unload, plan our next journey. I'll probably just use the rest of the time here to like replenish. I think I did good. I did kill the Jaguar, so that's wonderful. I wonder, do I actually have a place to sleep here? No, not really. Do I? Did I make like a bed inside? No, I don't think I did. Oh, look, we have some stones here. Why are the stones here? And a piece of copper. Why are they inside? I don't know. Uh, I think the best, ugh, best course of action here is to go sleep on the boat. Until the day comes, until until I can ha until I make myself a proper bed. Okay, okay, we actually have some fruits here that we can eat. That's pretty good. Uh, this will give us lots of water, and then some dried meat, roasted short eat dog. That's good for nutrition, so that's nice. Soup would be Jesus. I actually have surprisingly little food and water here, dude. I didn't bring any wood. No, no, no. No, there must be a whole bunch of water in this box, yes? Not in this one though. Here? There we go. I knew I had it somewhere. Okay, so that's... That's good. That's good. That's really nice to see. 
Okay, the day is coming and I'm super tired, so... What is this? Bandage with red gum. Let's use that and then let's sleep for one hour. Uh, okay, food is less than 60. Okay, let's just grab one of these dried foods then. There we go. I want to sleep. There. And I'll sleep one more hour here. The heat is coming though, so I should keep that in mind. Okay. Alright. Uh, let's go make myself a bed, I guess. So it seems like in the morning we could sleep here in the morning. Uh, so let's see. So a bed made of leaves, right? That's what we want to do here. Portable leaf bed. We could make a portable leaf bed. Allows to sleep anywhere. It is better to sleep under a roof and near a fire. Base restore rate is 6 energy per sleep hour. Okay, and then... A bed of leaves. Okay, this one's not portable. 7 energy per hour of sleep. I mean, it's not too bad. This thing... Gives 2% bonus to all disease treatments. Base restore... Okay, so... Let me see. Uh, can I make like buildings? A sleeping bag, right? TP hut. Mapping tower. Oh, that's the big thing we saw up there. You can also build it. That's cool. Lamp. Feel lasts a very long time. Feel consumption. Fit. Oh, so we can use this thing to illuminate the darkness. Okay. Let's make the let's make the portable bed of leaves. But it's not here, dude. It's not here. It's not under buildings. Let's just type in bed, maybe. Portable leaf bed. So it's under other items. There's like way too many other items though. There we go, sleeping bag. Provides sun and cold protection. So we would need two the right height and one tendon thread. Not sure if we have that with me though. Okay, we have the right height. Not sure about the tendon thread though. Those are so rare. Yeah, I didn't bring any tendon threads with me, like for real now. That's not great. I mean, it's not super bad either, but... It makes me a little bit sore that I don't have any tendons with me right now. So I can craft what I need. Improved ship repair kit. That kind of sucks. To tell you the truth. Okay, I'm gonna put the big stones here, the small ones in here. Uh, let's just make what we can right now. Portable leaf bed, there we go. And then, how do we use it? Place. Okay, game's like, no, you can't make it in the shade. That that would be too easy. You can't make it inside, because we decided that you can't make it inside. And then, outside, not, hu not huge fan of heat and stuff. So, like what? Not gonna be able to use that right now. So I'll go sleep in this bed for another hour, I guess, or two. I don't know. Get nice and sunburnt. Oh, actually, this bed's protected right now. That's pretty cool. Okay. Okay, now it's not anymore. All right. So I'm going to need a campfire. I'm going to need some bandages. Uh... Yeah, I don't think I initially intended to, like, have the base of, of operations here, but I guess that's what I'm gonna be doing. Let's grab the stones, though. We could also make the fire without the, the stones and stuff. That one's kind of a little bit worse, I guess, but... Depending on how permanent I want this place to be... 
So we have two fire types, right? You have this one and this one. Okay. And that was it to cook fried meat and fish. Let's make the, the, the one which is a tiny bit better, I guess. Okay. I mean, it is what it is. There. Place. 53 minutes to build. Yeah, that's not good. Okay. Okay, we need like a proper home here, I feel like. Okay, minus... Okay, let's see. Let's go here. At least we have plenty of water, so... It's not like I'm totally unprepared for this whole situation. It's just that, that this, this silent is so hot. Okay. Good. Now we can go and build this thing. Okay, so sun is strong, but... Okay. Right, so now we can ignite this thing. Do we have like any tinder or anything like that? We should have, right? Nope. Turns out we don't have any tinder. Really? Uh, we have wood chips. Yay. So this is for cooking food. Okay, it's hot. So let's take one hour break here inside again. And there. One more. Sure. It's not like I'm in a rush to go anywhere, but like, this is so clunky. <laughs> and I got attacked by the spider. Great. Uh, and where it is it now? It's on the other side. Oh, dude. There. Did I get poisoned? Nope. Haha, <laughs> spider. I win, you lose. Okay. Um. Okay, I need some more wood chips. Not sure if we should use these. Ah, shit. There we go. Now we can cook the food on it. Great. Okay, let's go make the eggs. And let's make... A lizard steak. Well, not really. It's like a. There we go. Good. Wood chips we're gonna place down there in... again. Oh boy. Okay. So I need a new spear. And I should really be using a flint spear, obsidian spear, which I actually have. But, like, you know. I would be used that. Okay, stone pickaxe, the bow and arrow, obsidian axe, that's alright. Okay, I need to make some bandages. So let's do that. Interaction. Steamed leafy bandage. One steamed leafy bandage coming right up. My health is 71 out of 100. Yeah, let's uh, let's place one on. There we go. And then the spider can go in here. And feathers, I don't know. I'm not gonna use these for a while, so let's also put them here. Let's put these here. There we go. Pieces of cactus. I guess we're gonna be crafting soon with that. Well, I don't know. We have two crafting boxes. I'm sure that's gonna be like a source of uh, many A. How do we repair this thing again? A stone spear. I mean, sure, why not? So yeah, these this bandages, even though they're not so, so amazing, they do get the job done. Okay, I have three right now. I should probably make a couple more. I also have some in the box now that I saw. But you know, let's make a couple more here. Okay, let's go. So they don't heal for much, but when you're like in downtime, it's like they, uh, yeah, they really help out to keep you alive. Right, so we need some more leaves. Let's grab them. Some more of these bandages, then the better. I probably have like a whole mountain of these also back home, but you know. Okay. If I didn't have such nice HP pool, I would probably get massacred by that yeah, Jaguar. I mean, I did panic a little bit, but in the end, I'm pretty happy how that all turned out. It wasn't that bad. 
Let's put this in here, actually. So this is like my main tool place. Okay, we have obsidian knife also. Mm. So I took all these good tools because I wasn't sure like how well equipped do I have to be. Turns out I didn't really need to be that well equipped, but still. Better be over equipped than under equipped, right? <laughs> That's for sure. Okay. Right, so yeah, this episode is nearing its end. So yeah, hopefully you did enjoy it. And if you did, don't forget to like and subscribe. I will go shortly over what's the plan for the next episode before I wrap it up though. And well, you might guess it. I'm gonna go and mine the copper. And then after that, we'll see if we can do something good with them. Basically. And yeah, we also have a medical kit. You know what? This seems pretty good, but like for like emergency situation, emergency situation, stuff like that. Oh, did this thing run out of fuel? It sure did. Okay. Uh, okay, we're gonna need some sticks also, so this doesn't happen again. That's all right though. I did mostly what I wanted, so that's fine. Okay, put that in there and Let's drop this thing here. We're gonna need a new one also. Okay, I think I'm gonna bring the food with me. Okay, let's put that in there. Bring the cutters with me. Leanna rope, I'm gonna keep with me. Okay, how heavy is all this together? 9.2, not too bad. The hide bag will break down though. I'll need to make another one. I'm gonna need some animal tendons for it. Which I didn't bring with for some reason. Like, why didn't I bring any animal tendons? I mean, I could make a quick sale back home and bring those. They're down here. There's a cannibal fruit though, let's eat it, I guess. Bed of leaves. Four hours. Okay. Cool. But yeah, that's gonna be it for this one. Hopefully enjoyed it. Uh, uh, have a wonderful day everyone, do something nice, be kind to each other, and let's make the world a better place together. Thank you all for watching, and see you in the next episode of Survival Fountain of Youth, the Neomers signing out. Bye bye.